nothing impresses people quite like a huge wad of cash. Having a gangster bankroll is a great way to let everyone know you're the life of the party. If you love to show off, a gangster bankroll might be just the tool you need. Part 1. Getting your money ready. 1. Get paid. You'll need plenty of cash to make an impressive bankroll. Find a way to put some money in your bank account. If you don't have a high-paying job, you can always pick up a few more hours at work or find another job to go to on the weekends. You can even try to sell some of your old stuff. Pawn shops will give you money for appliances you no longer use. You can sell your gently used clothes at thrift shops. Start a blog about something you know about. Offer to walk dogs or wash cars in your neighborhood for a small fee. 2. Get your money out of the bank. When you feel like you have enough money to put together your bankroll, take the money out of your account. Let the teller know that you need an assortment of different bills. You should have plenty of $100 bills, $50 bills, $20 bills, $10 bills, $1 bills. 3. Make your money look fresh. You can't have a flashy bankroll with wrinkled bills. Straighten out crinkled money so that it looks new. There are a few different ways to straighten your money. Put your money in the microwave for about 5 seconds. Keep an eye on it so that it doesn't burn. Go over your bills with a dry iron on a low setting with no steam. Be very gentle so you don't accidentally burn holes in your cash. 4. Face your money. Make sure your money is all right side up with the president's facing towards you. Your bankroll will look messy if the bills are facing in different directions. Make sure your bills are neatly coordinated in the same direction. Part 2. Organizing your bankroll. 1. Stack your money so that the largest bills are on top. Your $100 bills should be first followed by the rest of your bills in descending order. Your $1 bills should be at the very bottom. Be sure that you have a good number of $1 bills. They will make your bankroll appear larger. If you have $2 bills, you can place them after your $20 bills and before your $10 bills. Since they are rare, people will likely think they are $20 bills when they glance at your bankroll. 2. Fold your money over. The highest bills will be on the outside. You should be able to see Benjamin Franklin's face on the outside of your bankroll. Your $1 bills should be in the center. Make sure to fold your money evenly so that it looks neat. 3. Clean up your bankroll. All of your bills should be parallel. Use your fingers to push any loose edges back to the center of your bankroll. When all your bills are even, run your fold between your thumb and forefinger to solidify the crease. 4. Pattern your wad. The bigger your bankroll looks, the more impressive it will be. Stuff the center of your bankroll to make it appear larger. You can put ID cards, play money, or anything else that will fit in your bankroll to make it look huge. Make sure you can keep your stuffing hidden. It could be really embarrassing if anyone notices it. Part 3. Adding the finishing touches. 1. Find a thick rubber band. If you don't have any thick rubber bands laying around, go to the grocery store and buy a head of broccoli. The rubber band that comes wrapped around it will work perfectly for your bankroll. You may need to turn the rubber band inside out if it has the logo of the grocery store on it. 2. Tie your bankroll together. Wrap your thick rubber band around your folded money. You may need to twist the rubber band around your bankroll a few times to make sure it's held together tightly. You don't want any loose money to fall out when you take out your bankroll. The rubber band should be positioned in the center of your bankroll. After you tie your bankroll together, you may need to fidget with your money to make it even again. 3. Show off. When you go out, spend your bankroll lavishly. When you pay for things, flash your bankroll and let everyone see you rummage through all your big bills. Act like you have money to burn. Keep at least one $100 bill on the outside of your bankroll at all times. 4. Be careful. When you're not using your bankroll, 
keep it in your pocket. You don't want to misplace it or have it stolen. If you flash your bankroll on the street, it could even attract muggers and get you into trouble. Carry a wallet along with your bankroll to pay for things when you are not trying to show off. Always know exactly where your bankroll is. Tips Stay semi-cognizant. It's never a good idea to get too inebriated while handling large amounts of cash. Dress classy when you use your bankroll. You want to complete the image.